All right, so this is gonna be a little bit different video, guys. Um, what I wanna impress on, upon a lot of you guys that are, are in the industry or a lot of you guys trying to get in the industry right now is really like things aren't gonna be as simple and easy as something people make it out to be. But in the same focus, don't give up. Keep trying, keep pushing yourself because your mental capacity will grow. You will grow as a technician and again, right now there's such a shortage in technicians and people that we need, uh, like really, really skilled people that we need to keep the industry growing. And again, when it comes down to it, PLC programming is part of you know maintenance, it's part of a maintenance task, it's part of an engineering task, it's part of just a, uh, it could be a simple, uh, like, or, or a different, different technical role. But again, understanding how the machine works understanding how to read code, understanding how to troubleshoot, understanding how to program yourself is going to make you fluent. It's going to make you like that much more better than the next person. And we're, if we all start pushing ourselves and we all keep pushing ourselves and we're going to stay on the forefront of the industry and we're going to make things better. Now, I'm not saying learn from me. I'm not saying that you have to learn from me. I'm saying learn and learn from somewhere. But honestly, get the best practices. Always go after the best practices, what works, what you see works, and then go ahead and make it work for yourself. With that said, I just wanna make a short video and say we are in dire need of, uh, uh, again, solid PLC programmers, solid people that can troubleshoot PLCs, and solid people that can technically handle the situations. And as you grow your each and every day, you're going to get better. So with that said, we'll see you guys on the next one. And I appreciate everybody that supports this channel.